Hi everyone, this is Love Crafty Girl, and today I'm going to be doing the weekly spread in my mini recollections planner. Um, for this week, I actually had um, a, a printable made out for this one as well. Um, I This was actually my first printable that I actually made before I did the New Year's one for it. So here's last week's. Um, so for this week, I'm thinking of doing these now these are on paper they're not on sticker paper these were my actual very first um printable i guess you can say that i made i wasn't sure if i'm gonna like it so what i had done is i did it on paper i checked to see what it looked like i actually had if you i had um blue washi tape on the corners i wasn't sure if i wanted to put washi tape on the corner i mean that was my uh beginners one I guess you can say and then when I did the New Year's one uh, I used actual printable paper so um, for this one I'm gonna be using this paper um, so continue watching to see how I uh, create this week's spread So I'm going to use my new washi tape that I got at Dollar Tree. I'm going to use that blue one. I think it's really pretty and shiny and a perfect thing to use for this um, weekly spread. So I'm going to begin by placing it on the top. And at this point, I just decided to go with one um, strip. But I started to notice later, uh, which I don't record that part where I take it apart. Um, I wanted to have two strips of that. But I'll I'll do that one later and I, I'll let you know what I've done with that. So here I'm going to get another piece of it at the bottom and then I'm going to cut that and I'm going to cut that also into a little piece. And you'll see me also trim that off. And then the trimmings, I'm going to use it for the second page and use it for the bottom part of that page. Then I'm going to have leftover trimmings which will become the middle part um, that will go in between the squares. So as I'm working on this trimming, I want to talk to you about the top part of this page. In the beginning, you saw me put one strip of that uh, washi tape, but um, as I looked at it closely, I didn't like seeing all this white space. So I decided to take it off and reposition the tape. Well, one thing I didn't know is that this tape um, is very um, sticky. And as I lifted it up, um, a bunch of the paper came up with it. It didn't like tear off the page, but like the top layer of the page came off. So it looked like it looked really bad. So then um, I threw off the tape and I just ended up putting two strips of that same washi tape. And um, I felt like now it looks a lot better. So now here I am placing my squares. Um, I'm gluing each one with glue stick. And then um, I'll work on the second page. So here I am going to be placing the two strips of the washi tape. Um, I started to figure now that from now on when I do use um, the washi tape, I will do um, two strips of it if I'm going to use it on top. Unless I have a sticker that's big enough to cover that area or if the white trimmings doesn't bother me and that I can just keep it the way it is. But after I place these, um, I have to still trim it. So luckily the trimmings from... Um, cutting this goes perfect for the in-between of the boxes. One thing you're going to notice is when I put these trimmings um, into my page, you're going to notice that the width of these trimmings are not all the same. Um, and I don't really mind that actually because I noticed that the sticker itself covers a lot of that trimming. I mean, the, the point to it really is just to have some type of color in between them. So for me, I don't really need a perfect size trim um, in between. I just need them to be big enough to be seen through um, each sticker. Thank you. 
So here I'm laying out all the days of the week stickers before I place them down though. I want to decorate the top part of the page just because it was actually bugging me seeing all this blue and I want to make sure that um, my stickers are placed there. So I'm using the stickers from my sticker book that I made. Um, these are the stickers from the Recollections um, seasonal thing I have. And then after that I'm going to place my um, days of the week um, in their proper spots. So I'm placing these pretty blue snowflakes um, as my to-do list area and so I'm making sure that each day um, I have a little um, snowflake so that when my week starts next week for work I know what to write next to each of these snowflakes. So here's the final look to using this cute printable. I love everything I did to it. Um, the stickers I were they were actually from hold on where is it? Oh yeah, they're from my uh, recollection stickers that I had, and then I used these that are from the seasonal packet. So and this was actually coming apart, and that's why I was thinking of making a sticker book for this. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching this. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe so you can see what I'm going to be doing for next week's recollections um, spread. All right, guys, until next time.